Good morning. Oh, but good morning, Van City. It is a beautiful, beautiful day. We've got to run a bunch of errands. I have to get cleaning supplies and all of that fun stuff. Living things. Not living things. Things to live with. Necessities. I forgot that everything is in English and in French. I forgot of that. <laughs> to talk. How do I talk? What? Yeah, and it sucks. I can't like, I can't reply to comments or change my thumbnail and it's driving me crazy because I can't do that logging in thing that is necessary to use YouTube. And I can't comment directly back to people via my iPhone, which is now fixed. Yay for small victories, one at a time. A personal record last night, I went to bed at eight o'clock. I woke up at 4.30 like, oh, hey. So I thought I would show my outfit real quick. I just have my little Forever 21 beret, my Olaf William Beckett shirt, my Target little cardigan thing, the same pants from yesterday. Don't judge me. Most people wear their pants two, maybe three times. But we were on a plane and everything all day and it's so gross. Ah, germs, germophobia. I can feel them infiltrating my skin and my pores and getting into my bloodstream. <laughs> I love soap. Stuff you can't get in the US and it works wonders for your energy levels. Yes, it works. I had to call the front desk for the access code and then put it in and then it worked. So I guess there was some weird poltergeist activity happening. Clearly it was Moloch, the corrupter. Buffy, anyone? Bueller? quest to find a dollar store. We think we know where it is, but knowing our luck, it will be closed or under construction. Everything's being renovated. We have found it. We're loading up in here. We're gonna spend a fortune at the dollar store. How graphic. Mm -hmm. Kind of. So I'm just chilling at the hotel. This UPS thing is the one huge snafu we've had, which I'll take it. It's <laughs> if that's the biggest thing that goes wrong in this whole transition, then yay. I'm starving. I haven't eaten since three o'clock or so yesterday afternoon. It's a little bit after one o'clock in the afternoon right now. We're trying to get UPS to release seven of my eight boxes. We have one delivered and it's basically my HEPA filter and stuff and everything else is just sitting in the warehouse because they need my passport and my visa before they'll release it. And we have to do it before two o'clock today or it won't come until like midweek next week. It is Friday now and it's not gonna come until Monday. We thought it was gonna come before we got here. So that's kind of put a damper on the mood a little bit. It's hard to complain when you're looking at that. You can see the big ocean liners and the snow-capped peaks over here and a guy running on the roof. Hi guy. Hi there. Don't jump, it's not worth it. Your food looks so good, people. You're so lucky. I am such a creep. I'm all the way up here. <laughs> I cracked and needed a nom. Delta in-flight cookies are surprisingly delicious. And that is BC Hothouse Salsa. I'm not sure what that means, but I'm pretty sure it's synonymous with delicious. There is my favorite weather right now. It's like overcast and cool. It's perfect. This place is new and it looks just like Ikea to me, but smaller and funkier. That makes me think I could design plates. I'll 
I'll take it. Now, I'm just gonna say it's a view I could get used to. Yeah. <laughs> this is the Pacific plate pushing up so against the North and North American plate. This is on a fault line right here. I know. Right here is, is where it meets. That's what created these mountains. Yeah, if there's ever a flippin' earthquake, there's going to be a tsunami right and I'm going to die. Uh, no, <laughs> because this would protect you. The mountains? Yeah. We're in really? a sheltered harbor here. Yeah. That's Vancouver Island. Right, but we're surrounded by water on three sides. Yeah. Well, you're up the hill. So we're at the convention center with the giant whale and the Olympic torch and everything and they've filmed multiple episodes of Fringe here and other places too but they've probably filmed other things here too but they just did it this past season I was like oh hey I know that place. There's the Olympic torch. 2010 Olympics. If you ever wonder what happened to Willie, he didn't stay free. It's really cool that you can come out here and study. And then if you don't want to study here, you can go to the beach. City. Nature. I tried to film this bird and then it went underwater because somehow it knew. And whoa, seagull. Um, it hasn't come up yet, so I think it, it's a Canadian fish bird with gills. That bird has superior lung capacity. It could probably sing the opera and scuba dive to unknown depths. What music do you think he's listening to? If any of you watch The Killing, they film a lot of it in that building. That's where I take my daily bath. That really cute store that looked like Ikea had these robots. They were too armed, but they were on. They were selling them for like 14 or $15, and this one was on sale for $8.98. Oh, it was $14.97. Oh, I can read. Um, and they were selling them for $8.98. And I was like, oh my god, it was over in the reject pile. And it warmed my heart and I had to get it. It's really cool looking. It looks like something that I would fashion out of found objects. So, yeah, I, I couldn't help it. I gotta name him though. I don't know what to name him. I feel like he's male. I'm getting a male vibe from this. But yeah, I just wanted to. Oh, hey, curtain guys like the vlogs and I hope that you are having a good week. Bye. Bye. Uh, my hands are coming out of the bed. Well, these aren't even my own hands. What are they? There's a guy over in the apartment complexes and I think he can see me because I can see him. And it's creeping me out, man. Oh, I also have to edit this footage. <laughs> I want to stay ahead while I can because now that I am more than halfway through Vag, I have to finish. <sighs> Why did I call it that? Can you hear it in my voice? I need another night's sleep. I'm freaking frick frag and exhausted. <sighs> Am I changing angles enough right now? Dodge. Do Vark's even make a sound?